and the coaches. Wilbert is a saddle tank engine who came to the island of Sodor to see if Sir Topham Hatt needed a saddle tank engine on his railway. Soon after that, he went back to his own railway, but recently he was brought back to help work out with the heavy goods. Another reason why was the suspension bridge had collapsed, and it was up to Wilbert and some other engines to help repair it. One day, Sir Topham Hatt came to Wilbert's shed. Hello, Wilbert. I have a very important job for you. I need you to take some workmen all the way to the suspension bridge so they can repair it. Whoa, sir! But usually Edward takes the workmen. I only take the heavy goods. Why am I taking the workmen today, sir? Because Edward's way too busy with some work right now. He's too busy on his branch line and at the clay pits, the docks, the station, you know, the deal. So I need you to take the workmen instead. Goodbye. Wilbur was excited. Oh, that's exciting. I get to take the workmen. But when Wilbur was looking in the yard, the only coaches he saw were Annie and Cartabelle. Uh, hello, girls. Uh, do you know where all the other coaches are? Oh, hello, Wilbert. Um, you're going to be taking us today to take the workmen. You guys? But you're Thomas's coaches. Oh, Thomas doesn't pull us until later today. I'm sure he'll understand. Okay, then. Let's get going. Soon, Wilbert coupled up to Annie and Credibel. Come on, ladies, let's go. Oh, he is such a kind engine, Annie. Oh, yes, he is, Credibel. He is a kind engine. I'm glad you guys think I'm kind. Well, come on, we better hurry. We and Wilbert puffed off. Say, I've been wondering, girls, how does it feel to be pulled by Thomas? Oh, well, it's nice, but let's just say Thomas goes a bit too fast sometimes. Oh, yes, indeed. Huh, well, I'm excited that I'm taking you. Wait, what platform do we go to? I think we should go to platform one. I think that's the platform we're assigned to. Okay, ladies, whatever you say. But when Wilbert puffed into the station, he saw a lot of workmen. Bust my puffers! That is a lot of workmen. Calm down, Wilbert. It's not enough. Just be yourself. Uh, uh, uh. Wilbert was kind of scared. But soon he grew confidence. Okay, Annie. I'll listen to you. And Wilbert waited for everyone to get on board. Soon the guard's whistle blew. And Wilbert puffed away. Ladies, I've never done a job this important before. Oh, is that true? Yes, I've usually just done good work, but I'm excited that I'm pulling workmen and you. Oh, oh you're gonna make us blush. Oh, come on, Wilbert. We better pick up speed if we want to get there on time. Okay, ladies. And Wilbert soon picked up speed. Woohoo! Faster, faster, faster! Don't go too fast, Wilbert. We are old coaches, after all. Oh, sorry, ladies. I just love going fast. I always puff on my old forest railway. <laughs> it's quite fun. You should, you should guys should go there one time. Oh, we would like to, but we're busy on Thomas's branch line. <laughs> yes, I guess so. Soon, Wilbert made it to the suspension bridge. Well, ladies, we're here. Good job, Wilbert. Wilbert watched the workmen repair the bridge. But soon he had to go back to the station. A few months later, the bridge was repaired. Gordon got the express back, and Wilbert now puffs on the bridge happier than ever.